click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, in the previous topic we have discussed about the modes of decay that is alpha, beta and gamma and here basically we are going to talk about the terms nuclear transmutation and artificial radioactivity. So what are these two terms? Let me talk about that in this topic. So friends, let me talk about the nuclear transmutation first. So nuclear transmutation is nothing but it is a kind of a nuclear reaction in which basically one of the nucleate which is very much stable, it can be converted to an unstable radioisotope. So this is how basically it can be done by bombarding a certain kind of particle that could be alpha, beta or gamma. For example, let me talk about the boron. Boron has an atomic number of 5 and atomic mass number of 10. Whenever the boron is bombarded with helium having an atomic number of 2 and atomic mass number of 4, the product which has been formed is an unstable isotope that is nitrogen having an atomic number of 7 and atomic mass number of 13 while the rest of the mass is being removed in the form of neutron. This unstable isotope of nitrogen having an atomic number of 7 and atomic mass number of 13 is acting like a radioisotope. But this radioisotope obviously it is unstable, obviously it will be formed a stable compound and this is how basically we are going to talk about artificial radioactivity. The artificial radioactivity is nothing but the transformation of this radioisotope to another nuclide by giving out another particle. For example, the particle that has been produced, that is whenever a boron is bombarded with helium, so the particle which has been produced, that is neutron, as well as the main product which has been formed, that is radioisotope of nitrogen. So the same nitrogen, it can be transformed into another nuclear, that is carbon, having an atomic number of 6 and atomic mass of 13 by the elimination or by the removal of the positron. So this is how basically the second step which I have discussed about this is how basically the first step is nothing but a nuclear transmutation while the second step is nothing but an kind of artificial radioactivity which has occurred that is how basically a alpha particle and that is how basically a particle has been released in the terms of that is positron and that is how basically this other two terms that is nuclear transmutation and so therefore these are the two terms that is nuclear transmutation and artificial radioactivity and that's it thank you friends for watching this video i hope you have understood this video very clearly and i hope i'll see you next time till then don't forget to subscribe thank you so much